Jawan Johnson, the tight end out of Oregon. Johnson, a former receiver, started at Penn State, went over to Oregon, has moved now to tight end in the NFL. It gives you a, a really good tight end with a great, great catch radius and uh, knows what to do with the ball in his hands. Let's not forget, Jawan Johnson used to be a wide receiver. He has the speed. They put a little bit of weight on him, get him in there at that tight end position. He's pretty good at blocking, but that's where he can be really effective. They underestimate how fast he can get back up the field at that tight end position. Oh, he's a very large human being. 6'4", <laughs> 231. Jawan Johnson is uh, the undrafted free agent who they've had to rely on, like you talked about, with some of the receivers that they have out. And I know that Sean Payton really likes him. In fact, he compared him to Marcus Colston. And I remember talking to Sean years ago when Colston was a rookie in training camp, hadn't even yet played, and he says, we've got a really special guy. So to compare Juwan Johnson to him tells you what Sean Payton thinks of. Lave, like milk your screen. They can still pick up a first down without reaching the end zone. The throw goes to the end zone. Jawan Johnson, touchdown, his fifth in the last five games. Wow. Ah. Jalen Ramsey visibly upset. But here is Jawan Johnson going to stop in him. That's a good play. That is a good play. Nice touchdown. He's on their heels. Winston keeps. Throws and caught for the touchdown. Johnson. A couple of fourth down conversions on tosses to Jawan Johnson this time for the touchdown. Well, they go three tight ends, one lined up at fullback, and with pressure, Juwan Johnson, the newest tight end, who I said was a wide receiver a year ago, he goes up and makes the grab. He's big, 6'4", 231. Winston throws, end zone, touchdown, Juwan Johnson. Third touchdown of the season for the New Jersey native, Juwan Johnson. The extra point is good. Saints have tied things up seven apiece. Juwan Johnson's on the outside and finally gets one-on-one -on -one with Jabril Peppers. And I tell you, Jameis Winston, first option, he stares him down. And what a move. That stick at the top freezes Jabril Peppers. The one-on-one -on -one that he wanted, him against the safety, that is a mismatch. And Jawan Johnson exploits it. Great throw, great catch. How much more effective he can be. Blitz coming, picked up, caught down the sideline. And working his way is Jawan Johnson into the end zone. Exactly what the Saints needed. They needed to do it quickly. That's 17 yards. They had the ball for a minute and 40, went 46 yards, and get back in the game. Again, they walk everybody up at the line of scrimmage. Pressure is on this offensive line. And Dalton. Three third down conversions all game for the Saints. Still looking for their first touchdown. Humphrey was coming on the blitz. Juwan Johnson makes the catch. They're saying this is a live play. And he's in for the touchdown. Peters along the sideline thought that Johnson was out of bounds and nobody touched him on his way to the end zone. Let's take a look. Yeah, that's that's the question. But even at the end of this play, Peters is is there. But right after this, let's take a look. See, if, uh, I think he's in. It well, it looks. Yeah. It looks there like it might be on it, but nothing down the line. It's just hard. You know, you don't see you don't see green on the right of his shoe. You see sideline, but there's just nothing right down the line. I mean, that looks like he would be out, but just hard to tell. But out. That play of the drive is a third down and nine pass. Underneath Jawan Johnson, another first down. Spinning his way, lunging and reaching. They'll mark him down just shy of the goal line. Jawan Johnson continues to be a factor with Andy Dalton.
He converts again for 18 yards, and it's first and goal. Right, just a little shallow cross right here off the line of scrimmage, wide open, and then his ability to do things in the open field. Remember, he came into this league as a wide receiver. I'm not so sure that he didn't break the plane there, Adam. I think he broke the plane. Yeah, Andy Dalton knows. He sees what I see. Playing the goal line. It is a touchdown. We go until halftime. Third down and four for the Saints. Simeon looking for the end zone. He's got a man. Touchdown. He found Jawan Johnson. And the Saints stretch the lead to 23 to 6. And watch this. The tight end's going to run across your screen. Park it right behind 54 and expect 34 Hill to help him right here. He's got to get over into that zone. He's basically passing him off to the next backer. And look at that spatial awareness. Laura, I got to know if Laura Oakman's going to ask Sean Payton if he told the guys. But watch this strike from <laughs> Trevor Simeon. And that's precision accuracy. He had to move. Dalton has a man. It's Johnson again. He's caught it again for another touchdown. And the Saints are right back in this game. That is the fourth touchdown of the season for Johnson to lead the Saints. While well, they're playing a little zone, and you'll see Spillane right here. He doesn't run with him, but it is Wallace who jumps inside just ever so slightly. The non-interception. Here's Winston wide open. Touchdown, Johnson. His second. Absolute blown coverage, and Jawan Johnson has two. Well, these two, because of the rub, they run into each other, and Jawan Johnson is just left wide open. And how about these touchdown catches that he's making in this game? I mean, this, this shouldn't have been nearly this hard, but, man, he has shown an ability to go up and make a play. Golden. Turning and making the grab. Johnson, Jawan Johnson in the end zone. The old back shoulder play to the outside, he goes, and Jawan Johnson takes it in for his second touchdown of the night. Remember, he's a tight end, but a college-wide receiver, so you can flex him out. He's very comfortable, and look at the difference in size. 6'4", 230 against 5'11", 190. Put it up in the air, get a little rub route, but that's where the versatility of Jawan, Jawan, Jawan Johnson can really pay off for you down in tight near the goal line. He's getting the start tonight because Adam Troutman is out. Pressure coming. Dalton gets rid of it. It is caught. And it is Jawan Johnson again. There is a penalty marker thrown as well. We'll have to check the flag. But if it stands, Jawan Johnson has his second of the day. It is Rashawn Evans on the penalty. It is Johnson again yes. for the score. Working a little one-on-one -on -one right here. It's going to be a zone, but he's just getting jammed at the line of scrimmage and then finding that soft spot and cutting in front of the safety. That's just understanding that zone, understanding that feel, finding yourself that open space, and then basically get over. They want to protect those guys. Second down, Andy Dalton right down the middle. Jawan Johnson to the 36-yard line. And the Saints with three timeouts. They're going to go ahead, you would imagine, and burn one here. And hurry up. How good Jawan Johnson Yeah, this is here. That's really well done. He got on top of Luvu. And then and then nice read by Dalton, right? So nice patience. He threw him open exactly where he needed to be. Looks like he did the right Wait, thing. You know, he did a good job of that. <laughs> On first down, the pass is caught, and a beautiful grab by Jawan Johnson. Good throw, good catch, 27 yards. Excellent route by Jawan Johnson. He's going to widen J. Ron Curse there, and then he heads right up the seam, and see how he bends that to the inside a little bit. You already have the court or the safety beat because of leverage, and you're running the inside route. And his size, there's a lot of places you can put that ball. Dalton fires, and it's caught by Jawan Johnson for a Saints first down. Gain of 26. Now, this is a nice job. Jawan Johnson, he's going to climb. He's being covered by Troy Hill. 
Let's not forget, Juwan Johnson used to be a wide receiver. He has the speed. They put a little bit of weight on him, get him in there at that tight end position. He's pretty good at blocking, but that's where he can be really effective. They underestimate how fast he can get back up the field at that tight end position. And a nice catch by Jawan Johnson for a first down inside the 25-yard line. Good adjustment by Hill on the snap. Good adjustment by Johnson on the throw. Alave deep to clear that space right there, and you see Johnson. What a, what a great grab. We've had some great grabs so far, Adam. Hunton I mean, that's. And Johnson. Right. Really nice concentration by the big tight end, former, as we mentioned, wide receiver. Blocked by Ramchuk, and it's caught by the tight end, Johnson, moving a pile and takes it down near the three. in this soft spot right in the middle of the field you're holding him a little bit watch he just gets up there there's the gap right this there good without timing. their receivers and so far they've been able to put two back-to-back -to -back games together Dalton over the middle and the catch is made that's Juwan Johnson this is really a pretty throwing catch this is Mike Hilton against Johnson and look at John uh, Johnson just separates and then that throw, and Dalton gets it right over the linebacker and then drops it in there. On third and nine, Dalton looking in that direction, and he's got his tight end, Jawan Johnson, who's become a favorite target. He picks up 14 yards and a first down to the 40-yard line. They're just going to turn around a little spot route on the outside, curl back in, and you know what, one of the things you got to figure out here if you're the New Orleans Saints is on first and second down, you're going to get a lot of zone coverage. They'll mix it up, they'll change from quarters to thirds to all that, but you've got to find those holes, those soft spots Team. in the cover. Second down at 23, that pass right on the money, taken out to the 47-yard line. That just kills the momentum. Juwan Johnson made the catch. It adds into the blitz. Saints looking for anything. Johnson down the seam, threading the needle as Winston. And now they've got him. So can they get to that bye at four and one and start to get their guys healthy, get their guys back in the lineup? Daniel on a walk on the ball either. So the Saints have the ball, and Taysom Hill looks to throw. He's got an open Jawan Johnson and a first down into Eagles territory. So Taysom Hill has carried the ball six times and scored a touchdown, and he's gone two for two as a passer. Right, this looked like a coverage breakdown right here because, I mean, that, that is too wide open in that situation. Watch 83 right there working against Kaiser White. Just change momentum. They're going to go. Winston drops it off. That's Jawan Johnson, and he's got it. Screen. Down to the 29 yard line, 12 yards on fourth down. That's pretty good, and Matt LaFleur can't believe what he's watching. 
I mean, they come out, they throw it to Juwan Johnson, who got moved to tight end this offseason, and he leaks out after showing that he's going to stay in in protection, and they pick that up easily. Backed up to midfield, lost 10 yards on the penalty. Winston fires, caught, 34-yard line by Juwan Johnson. No pump fakes, comes back the other way, and that pass is caught by Johnson for a first down. Johnson spins his way into Jets territory. 15-yard pickup for Jawan Johnson. Excellent poise and patience by Taysom Hill in the pocket because he wanted Alvin Kamara on that same little route. He was with the knee and shoulder injury. Second down, nine. Here they go, right up the middle. Caught by Jawan Johnson. And after last week, brought down to the play by a couple. And did sneak away with a miss. PAT. Now they got a chance. And don't want a strike. Finds Jawan Johnson at the 31 yard line. This week and week two with a rib injury. And now Andy Dalton under pressure. And they get it off though. Jumping it underneath to his tight end, Jawan Johnson. And the former wide receiver who converted to a tight end last year picks up 13. Yeah, this is just on Andy Dalton. Smart. Keeps his eyes downfield. That's the most important thing, right? So you've got to get pressure, and that happens. And here comes the pressure. He keeps his eyes down. And he throws behind Jawan Johnson, but a great adjustment and catch for one of the bright spots of this Saints offense this year. First down, New Orleans. Yeah, nice job. Just a little bit of wiggle here. Watch. It's a little bit of an outside release to kind of get Kaiser White moving that way. That's where he gets the separation, as you pointed out, Joe. One, the Saints offense through two weeks has really struggled. Johnson has a catch, and that'll be good for a first down. Juwan Johnson. Juwan Johnson's in the slot. Dalton over the middle, completes. Right on cue, that's Johnson inside the five, and it will be first and goal, Saints. It's just fun to watch this guy develop. Johnson, they put him in the slot, just a quick, continue to get the ball out of Andy Dalton's hand. Jameis looking left the whole way. A pickup of eight in the end. That is Jawan Johnson. Wide receiver skills and a tight end body. Blitz coming. Winston is picked up over the middle. He's got a man and it's caught a little bit short. It was Jawan Johnson. Evan White pulls the trick, gets some confidence going with their potential. I haven't mentioned his name. He's out with a, a foot injury. For about a month and a half, they think. Johnson makes that catch there. And a career high for him. Hill able to connect. That's Johnson stretching it out. His first catch of the game down inside the 10. If the Saints want to continue possession of the football as we close in on halftime, that pass is complete. And Jawan Johnson, the tight end out of Oregon with the catch for a first down. This is really just a nice, quick decision by Andy Dalton. He sees zone, and then Johnson, he's just going to hook up right before Eli Apple can get to him. Olave is in motion. Ingram is the back. It's first and ten. And he's out to the 38-yard line with that quick throw right off the bat. The Abloh along with Andy Dalton was converted to Andy Dalton took his one-on-one -on -one shot. On first and goal, he finds Jawan Damn, Johnson Chris. at the Isn't five. That? Harrison Smith makes sure he doesn't get much more than that. Third down and two. Winston's pass is caught for a first down by the tight end, Jawan Johnson. So the Saints move the chains, gain of five. And Jan heard they put Hill in the game next. They're going to see a lot of him at quarterback anyway. Meanwhile, a six-yard gain starts next. Jawan Johnson again. Got number seven receiver here to the top of the screen as Dalton's back into throw. And over the middle, he's got Jawan Johnson. Dalton, stick route, and he's got Jawan Johnson who steps out to stop the clock at the 38-yard line with 34 seconds remaining. Yeah, just helping out, making sure TJ Watt is secure and then leaking. Dalton throwing it in his well short of first down, the catch is made. And he's got his receiver, it's the tight end with the catch. A hit by Diablo, a second grab for Jawan Johnson. And he picks up eight on third and nine, bringing up fourth and one. Interesting decision. Yeah. Johnson. 
Johnson again. This has been a connection that has started to pick up as of late. Remember, Jawan Johnson had the lone touchdown against Baltimore last week. It's spectacular. Second catch of his NFL career got called up from the practice squad. The rookie from Oregon. It's obvious. <laughs> First and 20. Dalton underneath. Boy, he and Jawan Johnson have formed a really nice connection these last several weeks. It really has been that that you're obviously, you know, with Jalen Hurts back, you're gonna have production. You're not gonna go four consecutive three and outs, you know, to start a game. Jawan Johnson fills the hole in that defense and gets a first down and stop. couple years about Johnson and developing him what he thought he could become and he really has developed into the player that they hoped and thought he could become. Jawan Johnson continues to be a factor. The timing and you know this is a kid that was this is a kid remember this kid was a wide receiver you know he was a wide receiver when he was picked up originally and a little piece of TJ there he's really worked on his game and really become uh, a, a really gifted target and the trust factor between he and Dalton has really grown. It's just fun to watch this guy develop. Johnson. Jameis Winston raved about Jawan Johnson. He's the guy converted wide receiver now with tight end. He's a guy that he wants to have matched up against the safeties. He feels like he has the speed to break away from him as you saw that under route and he has the ability and the size to body out those safeties for those catches. He Jawan Johnson's their leader with five touchdown receptions. Dalton has really liked going to him on third down this year.